Greetings to you today. I am so grateful to see you on this morning. It is Women's Day. It is our day. Us. Yes. It is Women's Day. Our day. Your day. I am so grateful to see you on here. I'm glad to see that you are doing well, that you are alive, and no one is having to make arrangements for your funeral procession. So you've already won the day because you have woken up today. God has given you another day, another opportunity to seize all the blessings and the great things that are coming our way. So. I'm here to push you into your destiny. I'm Latika S. Carter, CEO, founder and executive consultant of LSC Global. And I come to let you know as well, women, rise up and rule. It is our time to rise up and rule. We cannot afford to any longer be silent, meaning this. We can't afford to be silent. We can't afford to put our gifts and our talents, lay it on the floor, or because someone else is feeling bad, because we're so just, the word I like to use is synergistic. <laughs> we have so many great things going for us. We know how to do multiple things at one time. That's how we've been created to be as women. You know, especially if you're a mom, your grandmother, your wife, significant other, and then you have to work or you run your own company, you're on your business, your own ministry, what have you. We have to juggle so many hats at one time. So yes, we are synergistic. That means we know how to do, it's like a melting pot. So many things that are coming out of our bellies, working for our good, that we can do. I come on here to encourage you today as well as to give you this topic that I just wanted to hone in on. Girl, we got to get out of our own way. Can you say that with me? But you know, make it personal before you say it. Girl, get out of your own way. Because sometimes we're looking at people thinking they're in the way. The job is in the way. Maybe you're not making enough money where you are. So you feel like, you know, I don't have enough money coming in. This job is not paying me enough. Okay, maybe you also have uh, situations going on in relationships. You know, this person is in the way. I just need him or her to get out of my way. We're constantly saying what other people or other things need to do to move out of the way. But sometimes it's really a decision that we have to make on our part to move ourselves out the way. There is too much life to live. There is too much for us to do in this world, in this earth, in our families, our communities, the social communities that we support. We have a voice and it's time for us to utilize the voice that we have been given and rise up to the occasion. We can no longer afford to pass the blame on other people to say if they wouldn't have, if they couldn't have. So let me dive a little bit deeper. We can no longer afford to pass the blame onto our past. Well, if this wouldn't have happened in my life and if that wouldn't have happened in my life, well, I come to let you know today that you're better for it. Huh. You're better for it because of those things that did go wrong. Because we didn't always get our way and sometimes people did take advantage of us. We allowed it. And some people really may have done some things that you never agreed to. So they didn't have your consent. And they used you. They abused you for their own selfish purpose, their own selfish gain. So I'm here to remind you, your past cannot define you unless you allow your past to share with you what you can do. If you allow your past to speak higher volumes than you are speaking in your present and even into your future, we are in our way. 
So we have to get ourselves out the way so we can seize every opportunity that is coming along for us. We have to rise up so we can live the best life that we can live. So you know for yourself, we have to be honest. Where do you see yourself going? What is it that you want to accomplish? What do you want to accomplish this month? What do you want to accomplish this quarter before the end of the year, before the end of the summer? It's not about people being in our way. It's about us seeing differently, taking ownership of what we have, the power to change. And that is only us. So sis, I mean this from all sincerity. Get your butt out the way. But I cannot. But I won't. But this is going on. No, 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 no. But God is. But God can. And you have the strength. God has already put it on the inside of you. Sometimes we just want to lay there. and We want to play those same songs that keep us in those same depressed cycles or keep us in those same mental spaces. It's time to bust yourself loose and move forward so that you can see there is too much life out here for you to live. So going back to what I shared with you about your job, if your job is not giving you enough money, you have to also look at yourself with your spending habits. You have to also look at yourself with, with the amount of money that you're coming, that you have coming in and the amount of money for necessities like your bills, electricity, your phone, uh, clothes for your children, food for your children, just things like that. You have to look at the necessities of what is going out, your bills that are pulling your money out. What can you do with the little that you feel you have? You have to be able to look at your income for the month and put it against what you have going out for the month. Your credits and your debits. Debits is what's being taken away. Credits is what's being brought in. So you have to look at those things to see are some of these things that are being debited from my life or from my financial account, if you will, is this something that I caused for myself or is it something that I need? Because sometimes we pull in so much that we do not need. We will go buy this, we'll go buy that, and you already had it, you really didn't need it. Sometimes we'll get in an emotional shopping spree just so we can feel better, shopping therapy. But if we don't understand how much money is left over, how much we want to invest in ourselves and invest in our future from what's left over and then look at the amount budget that you are willing to spend. Maybe all you'll have is $50 for that week just for you to splurge. Then you have to look at that whatever is left over. Don't borrow from Peter to pay Paul. It's time for us to break those cycles. And if your job is truly not bringing you the money that you need, it's not bringing you the satisfaction that you need, you are the only person that can change that. So we have to rise up and make a decision to take control of our own life and go out there and do that thing. That means really look to see what would bring you some type of satisfaction. What would give you some type of higher income? What would give you the peace that you need? It's so, so, so important that we understand our cash flow. It's so, so, so important that we understand the income that's coming in versus what is going out, those debits, and what we have our spending habits formulated to just splurge on without it really making financial sense. So if we are in a financial bind, you have ways to go get some money. We are like a Proverbs woman. We are a queen. We know how to go out there and get that bread. And when I say, girl, get out of your way, being in your way sometimes really means that you don't want to let that bed go. You don't want to let the couch go. You don't want to let boo go. You don't want to do those extra things that you need to do to bring in what you have to bring in for a better tomorrow. 
it's no longer time for us to lay down and die and take it as it's coming our way. We have to rise up and deal with the things that are coming at us and properly handle them and no longer put them on the back burner. So if it's a financial situation you're finding yourself being challenged is in, I would love to have that conversation with you so we could talk about what you have coming in versus what you have going out, how to save, how to pay off certain debts if you know you wanna be debt free. Who really wants to have bills? I mean, we're, we're always gonna have to have utilities, um, water, lights, a place to live, things like that. But who really wants to pay all those extra bills that we ourselves could be making. So if you don't know what to do, or you just need a good starting plan, a, a good uh, roadmap, if you will, I want to share with you how I can help you give, give you some free, fresh air. And that is by, give, by signing up for a free consultation. Did you catch that? Free. You are worth it. I know you are, that's why I said it's free just to have a consultation with me and put it out there on the table. Let me assess where you are financially. Let me also get in a, in a position where I can make, help, make, help you see a better way to place your money where it needs to go to grow taking care of your, your financial obligations, being able to put money to the side, and still feeling like you have something left over if you just want to do something for yourself. It's a simple conversation. But if you want to take it a step further, I would love to put you in a fast track with me, a fast track digital workspace that I have with me. And this is my fast track coaching program for 30 days. You can walk away. $25 starts you off. You can easily walk away at the end of the 30 days. If you, you can take all of the knowledge that I've already shared with you, all of the wisdom, you can take everything that I have given you and walk away after those 30 days and say, you know what? Thank you, this is enough for me. I no longer want to continue. No obligations, nothing further. But if you know the roadmap is going to help you and you have big dreams, you have big goals, you just need that help, I am your girl here to assist you. I am your coach and I would love to welcome you into my coaching program. So first, let's just start off with a free consultation. Let's get to know one another. Let's find out where you are in your life. Let's, let's talk about what you want to do what kind of life you want to live, what you want to accomplish, and maybe you don't really know what's on the inside of you. That is something that I am great at doing, is identifying the gifts and the talents that is on the inside of you. So it's easy as one, two, three, sign up. LSC Global, LLC.com a free consultation. You can go on there, click on your, your free consultation. There's no obligation. You can walk away and we are good. If you wanna move through the fast track, I am here to assist you. After the fast track, it's only 30 days. I wanna show you what I can do for you in 30 days. Can you trust me just for 30 days? Can you invest in yourself for 30 days? It starts off with $25. $25 a week for 30 days. Or you can pay it up front or you pay it bi-weekly payments. It doesn't matter. I am here for you. I wanna see you win. And I wanna see you get ahead. I wanna see you get everything that belongs to you and not hold anything back. You deserve it and it's time for you to know what you deserve. So get your butt out the way and live this life not exist in this life. God is too good for us just to live day by day, suffering, going through pure challenges, going through so much trauma and drama when you have people who can assist you. So you're not seeing this by accident. I am sharing this with you because I want to see you win.
try me out and see. Again, that website is lscgloballlc.com. I look forward to being able to at least have a consultation with you and help change your life. I know you're going to have an amazing day because it's Women's Day and you are rising to the occasion so you can rule. I love you. Peace and blessings. 